So I thought I would do a quick video on the Lux. Maybe you are trying to decide between the Keens and the Wonderful. Maybe you don't know what the Wonderful looks like. Um, so I just thought I would do just a really quick video. This is the Wafer Lux. I've had it a year now. Um, this net is from Amazon. I can post the link if anybody wants to know. Um, here is the new Wonderful console. It's got four cup holders. Middle pocket that goes pretty deep. A very large rear pocket. This is the wagon widget. <laughs> um, the front has a zipper pouch. And then there's a white pocket behind the magnetic pouch. You got your two pockets. You got your rear bag. This is only on the Lux. That's got pocket, pocket. This version is only on the Lux. Um, and then the inside opens up. And it is pretty big. I got just a bunch of junk. My fans, some diapers, mom life. Um, and then behind here, you have three pockets. One, two, three. They are pretty large. Um, over on the side, I have buggy baby hooks off the Wonderful website. Uh, Coco Melon Tag Along for my toddler. Um, this is how I install the Bugga Baby hooks. Buggy Baby. These are metal. They're really nice. Um, and on the Lux, the canopy is completely adjustable. So, if you have Baby over here, this shade nuts from Anna Wonderful, by the way. If you have Baby over here and they're in the sun and you want to lower it, it's fairly easy to do. The Keens does not do this. So, you could stroll around like that. Kind of looks funny, but I've done it when I have an infant over there. Um, you could also lower this part. And there you go. Say you have baby sleeping and you want it completely dark. And then to raise them up, you just simply pull. Each side. It's kind of tricky with the shade nut. Kind of got to mess around a little bit. But there you go. Now your canopy is back up to normal position. It's very nice. You can fold the wagon with it. Um, on the inside, I only have one seat in right now. There's the other one. I have the wonderful snack tray. Obviously a seat. Um, wonderful snack tray is reversible. Not sure why you would want a reversible one, but whatever. You got your spots for cup holders. It comes off just like the Keens one, I'm assuming. Um, wonderful, wonderful seats do recline, and that's really easy to do. You just unhook the C clip, U clip, whatever you want to call it. Move this buckle to the middle. Move that buckle to the middle. Move this one this way. And then you would just simply push down. And there's your reclining seat. The shade nut makes it look funny, but it is pretty reclined. Um, and then I'm just going to take it off for a minute and show you the inside of the wagon. Okay, so this is the inside of the Wonderful. I do have the all-weather mat. Um, Wonderful does come with an extremely padded mat on the bottom that is like a pack and play. And that's right here. Keens does not have that. Wonderful also has a trap door. It's only accessible on the outside. Um, like that. It's fairly large. It zips back up, and the zipper is kind of hidden if you have kids that are a little bit grabby. Here's a large pocket where I keep my mosquito net and then a strap for bus style seating. I have some jujube clips under here that I use for my cooler or other various things. Um, and then Wonderful does have this drop down panel. The Keens has one, but it is on the outside and it does kind of look lumpy with the toggles, I will admit. <laughs> 
but this is one side that doesn't have it done and that side is down it has velcro to connect it's not fully connected right now but you just simply unzip this and you pull it out and then when you're done so you just pull it out and then when you're done you zip it up and it stores away nicely and then when you want to use it it just drops down it's kind of tricky to do with one hand i don't know if it's gonna work but yeah you get the picture that's how you store it um it's out of the way and it looks clean and then when you want to bring it out you just simply velcro the bottom spots And there you go, that's what it looks like. Um, and then on the outside, you can't even really tell it's down, honestly. Like, where's the Keens? It's on this part. Um, these are spots for the canopy poles to go in. Um, if anyone else wants to know anything else about the Wonderfold, feel free to message me. There's a view from the inside. Um, and then this is the RoboCup holder that I do use.